Has this ever happened to you? Oh, ah, oh my goodness! Oh my cramps! Well in this video, I'm gonna quickly tell you exactly what to do. My name is Dr. Story. I've been a chiropractor for over 24 years. I'm gonna give you some realistic advice based on my experience. Okay, so let's say you're getting a, a cramp in the back of your calf. Here's the quick answer of what to do. What's gonna happen is, if the calf is cramping, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your toes and you're gonna straighten your leg and push up against your heel of the opposite foot. And when you're doing that, you're gonna really strongly contract the muscles of the front of your shin, and that will actually very quickly stop the cramp of the calf. The reason this works is because of a neurological principle called Sherrington's Law of Reciprocal Inhibition. Boy, that's a mouthful, isn't it? And what that means is, when your muscle in the back of your leg is, con is contracting, the way to relax the muscle is to contract the opposite side. So, just like a bicep and a tricep, if you contract the muscle of one side, the brain actually neurologically shuts off the other side and will relax that muscle. So when you're pulling up the toes and you push up strongly against your other foot, you're contracting the front of your, your shin right here, all those muscles there, and that will neurologically shut off the calf cramp. Some people will think that a banana, because of its potassium and magnesium, will stop a leg cramp. See, it doesn't work. Some people also think that salt will help a leg cramp. No. Some people actually say that rubbing mustard on the leg will help a leg cramp. What do you do when you want to go to bed? Cramp's gone, everybody's happy, time to go to sleep. If you like my videos, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share it on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And if you have any questions, ask in the comment section down below.